Hi, I am Dr. Deepika Gandhani from Indra IVF Jaipur Jawaharlal Center. Three things about genital tuberculosis. One is symptoms. It can be completely symptomless and only present as infertility, or it can have chronic pelvic pain, irregular vaginal bleeding and vaginal discharge, night sweats, and fever. On investigation, ultrasound can be completely normal and sometimes, uh, and also it present with uh, hydrosalpines or swelling in the tubes and uh, fluid filled tubes, irregular endometrial lining. On HSG or diet test, it can show the irregular endometrium along with that tobacco pouch appearance of the fallopian tubes. Uh, then on laparoscopy, we can confirm the diagnosis and hysteroscopy as well. There are tubercles uh, all around the uterine lining. Uh, inside the cavity and as well as in the peritoneum. There can be dense adhesions and strictures. For the treatment, you should go for the ATT when the tuberculosis is confirmed with the advice of a physician or uh, your pulmonologist. And post the tuberculosis treatment is complete, you should take an advice from an infertility specialist because tuberculosis damages the fallopian uh, tubes uh, so much that they lose the capacity to fertilize the embryo. Hence, the need of IVF is uh, there in the cases of NTB genital tuberculosis. Take an advice from your consultant quickly.